This video is sponsored by Blue Land. More about them at the end of the sketch. It's the 90s. The year is 1997. Welcome back to the show. I'm here with our time-traveling reporter who's reporting live from the year 2023. Terrible to be here. I don't like it at all. Please bring me back to the 90s. So what's going on in the year 2023? I saw a treehouse I used to play in as a kid listed on a real estate website for 2.3 million. But like other than your personal problems. Actually, that kind of feels like an issue for everyone and I would just love to come home. Well, we're currently troubleshooting a problem with the time machine. It's Seems like maybe someone from the distant, distant future managed to hack it or something. Hi there, hello, everything's fine in the future. Please send us some of your flesh for no suspicious reason. They seem pretty friendly though. Anyway, what are some new trends in 2023? I don't really know, but it seems like AI is making some pretty serious progress. Oh, well, we already have some AI in the 90s. We have a thing that sometimes manages to beat a chess master at chess. Yeah, we're a couple of notches up from that now. People are kind of afraid they're gonna lose their jobs. Whoa! Okay, so chess champion's like a major job in the future. No, it's getting pretty good at non-chess jobs as well, so some people are concerned. Not me, though. I would love for that to happen. You want people's jobs to be replaced by computers? No, I would like my job to be replaced by a computer. What? And then maybe I'll cryogenically freeze myself and give the distant future a shot. I do not like it here. Well, to be fair, the distant future does sound pretty friendly. Please insert your fleshiest limb into the machine now. But I don't really think you could be fully replaced, time-traveling reporter guy. Oh, I beg to differ. See, I actually got a nerd to build an AI version of myself. Isn't that right, nerd? I'm just like a normal guy. This technology is pretty accessible now. So this big old freaking nerd that I guarantee has never been with a woman built an AI version of me, and the differences are imperceptible. Well, so how does this work, exactly? Well, first of all, he trained a voice model to sound exactly like my voice. A voice model? Like a, like a radio commercial actor? Exactly. Not at all. Well, let's hear it. Hi there, hello. I am definitely the real time traveling reporter. Please send me back to the 90s. 2023 sucks. Well, that does sound like you. Right? But I don't really think I could just interact with a voice. That's not good television. And my doctor gave me some pills to stop that from happening. Well, actually, I had Point Dexter here make a visual AI version of me as well. Uh my name's Lewis. What are you, what are you, what are you, what are you talking about? What's the name of the AI thing you use? I just used Dolly 2. It took like three seconds and it's not very good. Dolly 2? Did they clone that sheep again? Not that I know of. Did they make another Dolly Parton? Did they? Unfortunately not. No, Dolly is one of many AI image generators out there. It's a totally convincing replica, so you're really not gonna need me anymore. Okay, I guess let's try it out. Hi there, hello. Oh my god. It's not great yet. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I can leave now. I am from the 90s. Don't forget to feed my Tamagotchi. Please bring me back to the 90s now. How does he even know how to say these things? I love Beanie Babies. Beanie Babies are my favorite. Let's play some Crash Bandicoot. Pass me that Sunny D. Well, those are things that I wrote for it to say. Ah, so see, you can't leave, because you gotta write things for the monster to say. Actually, no, because we could just power it on this thing called Chat Chippida. Chat GPT. What the hell is Chat Chippida did? Chat Chippida is like a chat thing that knows a bunch of stuff, and you can ask it questions. What do people use that for? A lot of coding stuff, a lot of cheating on college essay stuff. Go ahead, AI version of me. Tell the host something interesting about the future. The leading cause of death in 2004 varies by country and demographic group. See, that's pretty good. He could totally be a reporter. Wait, why did it just say that? It probably knows that you die in 2004. Hey, AI time-traveling reporter guy, how do I die in 2004? I'm sorry, but as an AI language model, it is not appropriate for me to share explicitly violent stories. Explicitly violent? Oh my god, what is it talking about? Can I go? I'm bidding on a treehouse, and if I don't get it, I'm gonna be homeless. I can, however, share a relevant fun fact. Did you know that human blood boils at approximately 100 degrees Celsius? Oh, holy shit! Hi there, hello, it's me, I'm the Adstronaut. I'm out here in ad space to talk to you about Blue Land. So listen, if there's one thing I hate, it's being attacked by bears. But if there are two things that I hate, it's the bear thing, and then also how much single-use plastic gets tossed into the ocean. Well, luckily, Blue Land can help with one of those things. It's not the bear one, but I'm still pretty jazzed about it. See, cleaning products usually come in single-use plastic containers, and man, oh man, do those add up, not to mention taking up a lot of space in your home. But with Blue Land, all you need for your cleaning products 
products is a little nickel-sized tablet and a forever bottle. Forever, you know, as in I will forever be afraid that one day bears will figure out space travel. I got the Blue Land Clean Essentials Kit with foaming hand soap, multi-surface cleaner, bathroom cleaner, and glass and mirror cleaner. You just fill your forever bottle with warm to hot water, you plop a tablet in there, let it dissolve, and it's ready to use in a couple of minutes. And Blue Land products are made with clean ingredients. We're talking EPA certified, cruelty-free, and vegan. Because I care about animals, even though I'm pretty sure bears are out to get me. So hey, if you want to get 15% off your first Blue Land kit, just click my link in the description. It's extremely clickable. Thanks, Blue Land. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs>